be one for the books here for Combo Breaker. Both these young individuals, this is exactly what I was looking for, right? That boom, and we saw the threat of the heart raid. We did see the lucky tender go past the boom the first time. What's gonna happen here in this mid-range combat? Idom, he's not gonna set the pace further out just yet. There's oh, the heart raid. You see the mm -hmm. damage dealing. You see the significant difference between both both attacks. Idom again gonna have the advantage if he continues to trade off of these booms with the heart rate. Oh, Kaba's gonna have to go and get the win, and that's the Again, the wall of this normals. is gonna be this is what sets the tone, right? Idom is gonna be playing. Damn, that was actually wow. mad far. He's gonna be setting the pace primarily with his heart rate. Kaba needs to find a way to get within mid range. He cannot afford these trades. EX to make a guess, the fade away and play, and Kaba with the sorry, Idom with the first thing with Kaba. You're absolutely right in terms of boom trades. And also, I feel like it's kind of deleting his normal game, but he wants to get, in to get the win. He's already stopping him with the whips, already hitting him. He tries to back up for the zoning and it's denied the damage applied from the whips. You see it right now. Like, as soon as Idom gets within a certain range, maybe a little bit past medium kick, at least at the range of a fierce from Guile, he's going to switch to his own whip with standing heavy punch primarily. But if Kaba, okay, if he had maintained his charge and gotten the knockdown, mm -hmm. he would have been able to take full advantage of Idom in the corner. Mm -hmm. But here it comes. Kaba, a little bit too reliant on these booms, getting a little predictable. Watch out for that stun. Idom threatening with the heart rate again. He's canceling, waiting for the booms. He's looking for a pattern. He might get this trade, but no, too a little far too out. far out. For the lovely tender, here comes Kaba on the assault Boomers. now. He's got the bar at the bottom. Don't we spend the win just to get some sort of win situation? Anything at all to stem down the momentum that Idom has. The trade, the dash up though from Kaba. He's trying to find a way to finish it. EX will connect with Sun up to kill. Idom could smash on a lovely tender real quick with it. Careful, Kaba with those moves with the area right it. there. He's I so love smart. It. That was a near instant jump. Medium kick. Mm -hmm. The range on it and the speed was enough to stop Idom. I'd imagine Idom tried to jump in with a fierce. It's so far down to reach and punish Kaba possibly, or at least get himself started. Either way, all tied up here in the rounds. Looking at the meter, it's near identical. It looks pretty even to me, but right now, Kaba is slowly getting that lead. Idom is about to lose all of this, all the momentum, I feel like. Kaba has just been putting on with his normal mid range Absolutely. to close range. You know, part of that comes from Kaba change up his spacing, not giving up too much time with the booms, getting that mid range game and just threatening with the normals, with the booms, the buffet of booms right now. Items eat too many. They're going to die. You better double up, Ooh. actually. Don't even let go of the booms, because this is what happens once you let go of the gas pedal. Idom now establishing this dominance. Mm -hmm. And look at the range that she gets to play on after the critical art. Accelerating. He's got the lead, but Kaba still has a lot of bar to work with. A lot of butter to cook with. What's on the menu? The V reversal. Not I today. don't deny it. Let's go to different restaurant, but the super. This won't kill. This won't kill, but it will. Put them about even. Should a break. Idom's favorite mechanic. Oh! Right from his face. Oh, I gotta take that replay again because I, I don't know if there was anything to back up that crouching heavy punch. Something going in. It was the right option. Idom. With the lead. I like Kaba. that. Yeah, back up a bit. Ooh. Now the flash kick the anti-air. You see Idom getting a little bit more impatient because of the fact that Kaba has not relied on the booms as much since the last game. Absolutely. Flash kick again. Kaba, anti-air. A two. I really three. like the fact that he is going for the normal. He hasn't pointed out. That's making it difficult for Idom to deal with it. No trades if nothing happens. On the screen. But you mean to kick target combo? Oh, Ooh, that was it. Did you see that? The jumping fierce. It extends so far out and stuffs out the crouching heavy punch anti air attempt. Ooh. That could have been it. The, oh, the sweep. sweep. The Hail Mary sweep. You gotta be kidding me. That was still gonna be trigger activation no right, matter right, what. Right. I still can't believe it. Idom ran into the sweep. Didn't even need to fear the V trigger. Kaba actually gets to breathe easy in game two for that one. Keep that pressure, that momentum. Do something different. Sweep again. Oh, you cannot kick. jump. I don't think real impatient. Kaba making a play to his rhythm. Interruption on the lovely tender. Preemptive with it. Activation from Adam. Team running back. The V reversal. Still a fantastic distance for Kaba to play at. Not too far out. Not oh, too he's close. Cooking up. He's actually totally satisfied with that. Not too much damage taken because of the burn. Not bad at all. Still has that light lead. That's going to be the a punish. punish. We talked about the heavy punch from oh. that range. We talked about the heavy punch from that range. Oh, players. It's not just about the zone, it's not about the, uh, but just about the normals. It's like combining them together in a frustrating pattern to make people like, even people like Idom break down. Ever so important right now. Again, all tied up one to one. Kaba still needs to make this reset happen in order to see 
that victory lap. But either way, Idom right now still a, a big hard rate again. Yeah, Kaba has resorted to the Sonic Boom pressure. That was such a good wow. read. He gets himself out of the corner, not a big punish. It's totally fine. However, Idom and Hot Pursuit still an excellent time to get out of the plus frame situation. That V-reversal ever so pivotal. Kaba now resorting back to the Sonic Boom game. Just barely missing the mark against Idom. EX to double check him. Flash Blast kick. kick. Get out of my face. And now he's going to worry about throwing out the boost. So now Kaba goes in a little bit more. He looks closer, make it hard to react to the EX. Love you, Tinder. And Idom trying to get these trades, but still Kaba, I seem like he's very comfortable right now. Let's have a crush. Easy activation from Idom off the crouch. He's going to follow up. Falls to the Molotov. And look at that, burning up just a little bit. I don't think there's going to be enough damage. If he doesn't EX Lovey Tender, it might kill. But at the same time, Kaba is even going to give him that situation. The throw bait, nothing to do with it. Kaba was standing his ground. No throw baits over here. Mm. You know what's also good? We've seen Idom do these micro shimmies throughout the entire tournament. Kaba's denying that with standing life, then the back fist. Just to check that walk back. Make sure that Idol doesn't feel too comfortable. And right now, I think Idol's breaking down the wall. Look at that. The boom oh, pressure hard to punish. lead. It's so difficult, too, because he has to stand block that. It doesn't give him enough to punish with afterwards. The flash, flash kick. kick for sure. Kaba 100% ready with that, at least. The mirror reversal. Does get throw. Throw. You yeah. saw the start above it. Idom now. He does have this corner pressure. Do not let your normals whip, though. Kaba, he does have critical art on deck. That back throw didn't work though. Kaba backing up a bit. Too sharp of an angle for the flash kick. Mm -hmm. He knew. This will jump. That's gonna be a punch in the super. Kaba getting closer and closer. He's getting a close range thing. It's a full complete package. We talked about that with Mono. He has but I to, think, right? I think Kaba's that way too. That's the thing. I, there, there's so many sequences that he has to go through in order to even break down the defensive item. It's just mm -hmm. been so active and pretty much hard to read at this point. But Kaba again. Utilizing his own offense against Idop, which is pretty funny because he'll, he'll shut down the boot game whenever he feels like it. It's been so ambiguous as to what approach he wants against Idop forcing wow. these errors. We rarely see these kind of errors from Idom. There's a lot more, a, a lot of reads coming in from Idom, more so than reactions. Right. And that is the sign of not being comfortable with EX. He'll definitely take that throw. Not much more. He reverse, he'll get some distance, and that builds up the gray left to make moves for a lot harder. Look at that. Triple of damage. Kaba again, comfortable. Try to sweep over the trick card. Didn't work in Idom. Gonna take him to the corner. The B skill. Run up the kill. I'm not sure what he was doing there. Oh, the stare down. Idom just needs at least one touch. Medium. Oh, actually, a light would do it. And so mm. does Kaba. He actually gets it off of the crowd's jab. Crowd's jab followed by the boom. Even, even at that rank, he's still able to continue the combo. So just in case if Idom wasn't dead, he had to sweep the follow up. EX, as soon as he saw the back turn, had something for him. Kaba looking to reset the bracket right now. Upside down kick, getting aggressive with it. The air to air right there, we saw that before. Oh, crouching heavy punch, even from that range, still finds the mark. Very, very fortunate for Idom, but now Kaba gets to establish his pace, right? He does get the Sonic Boom game, he does check with the forward fears. Idom is totally settled here on playing out of the corner. There's the counter hit conversion now. Gets the high heel, side switch off the Molotov as well. Look at him cook up. Do you like original recipe the or flash extra kick. crispy? That flash kick straight out of the oven. And now Kaba is still in this corner. <laughs> He's cooking up now. One touch to tech is so important. No punish on the sweep. Nothing. It's so close. The heart rate again. That trade off is what sets wow. the boys from the men. Mm. Idom definitely ready with that Sonic Boom again with the trade off. Consistency. Able to get the win. Idom, I like him being a little bit more aggressive, walking up. He's a lot more buttons. I feel like before he was backing off too much in these early parts of the round. Let me be careful to predict it. Waste the bar, and that still allows Kaba to get more, more comfortably. Let him fly for free. The challenge on the dash, but what catches an the shimmy. Did you see how he pinch pocketed Idom from that fierce? He threw in that, that crush medium punch. It's in your wallet. Perfect, that's a perfect time, too. Interruption DX. Oh, so has him in the corner. That was a flash kick attempt. Kaba actually missed it. Kaba. He's got to be able to set that oh, bracket. Boy. Don't let Idom get all this momentum. Can't take too many more trades. That and is the trade. That is the trade. A lot more buttons. He's not smiling upon one of the tries with the heart rate, with the things like that in the crouch here. He's actually going in to get the win. And it's messy with Kaba's timing a bit. I like him not being stationary. And I think it's a very valid point, right? You are messing with the timing of Kaba just a little bit, right? A little bit less reactions, mm. a little, or sorry, a little bit less instinct, a little bit more reactions, right? Bro, EX, you gotta hold this, this. 
A lot of defense and Alex used to block it out. Look at the prey line. That was extra damage on top. The anti-air is there, close to stun. Are we even gonna get there? Here comes Kaba. He's gonna make violent comebacks. All throughout this bracket. Gets the hit off the boom. What awareness in the flash kick. Closer, closer to the stun. Trying to get it done. The oh baby boom, the timing! He called a uh, flinch in. Uh, That's two of uh, the arms. Oh, and the wait, super. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh, he no. dropped it. He oh, dropped no. it. He did not. Vicious. He did not. I don't know what that was, but the confused look from Idom, he said, huh, huh, I actually was supposed to punish that. <laughs> what had happened? We saw the crouching heavy punch. There was supposed to be something followed through with it, either a sonic boom or even just, you could actually just connect it off with the crouching strong by right. itself. You could cancel it straight up. It just so happened that there was a mix in between. Kaba just might have missed an input. But either way, he still got very fortunate that he got that ender. Right, the momentum. I'm still not shaking, though. That That's was, the least weapon beat, though. That was a very expensive date, that was for sure. <laughs> Didn't lead to much. It led to much for Kaba. For Idom, not so much. Might be a reset bracket. The activation, though, Idom. Trying to cook him up a bit. He's in the heat in the flames, but this is fine for Kaba. He plays with his heart, he plays with the heat. Of the DR. That was a big whip punish. Critical art incoming. More oh. than necessary, to be honest with you. If you have the cash, you better spend it. Ugh. My I God. like that. Idom again. Looking at tournament point. point. Final round. This could also be reset. Can Kaba come back to the brink? We've seen it happen in many tournaments. If he can just get a hold of the rhythm of Idom. Can he break down the wall? That is his Capcom Cup champion. And I like that, yes sir. Firing away with that EX. That was gonna be the great divider between the momentum shift. Again, having that EX was so important. Ida was not able to set the pace at all. Okay, wait a minute. Fighting close quarters. Checking, look at the stare down. He's waiting, stare and that's down. totally fine. You know, a little bit of chip damage, allowing Ida also to back up. Kaba does get the EX. Big counter in conversion. Three He's piece. in pursuit. He smells blood in the water. But Ida has all. Damn near full stick of butter. And he's got the Molotov to burn up just a little bit. I like that. Do reversal against the heart rate. So space up in this place. EX, Kaba going in. It's an overhead to reset the bracket for that win. Kaba! Looking at his crew, feeling their energy, riding that momentum. Shade. You know what that was? Shades of Minardi. You know what that was? Talk to me. When Talk he, to he me. did that overhead, he looked up to his brother. He's like, I knew that was going to work. <laughs>